In today's tying tip, we're going to be looking at thread control, more specifically, capturing and top tying material. Struggling to capture material can really put a damper on rhythm, quality, and efficiency of tying. When you tie without thread control, you can notice how when I keep tension on the bobbin and the thread and do a top pinch wrap, it pushes all the material over and to the side of the hook. The solution to solve this problem? Easy. Spinning your bobbin. For right-handed tires, you'll be giving the bobbin a spin in the counterclockwise direction. And for left-handed tires, you'll be giving the bobbin a spin in the clockwise direction. The whole point of spinning the bobbin is to tighten the thread, which in turn makes the thread jump backwards toward your finger or the barb of the hook. Take the material in your hand as far up as possible. Take one loose wrap allowing the thread to jump backwards when you loosen up on the bobbin. Make sure you have the material cut flush if you want a blunt tie-in. When tying material on the top of the hook, keep your index finger tightly pressed on the hook shank. This will allow the material not to slip over when you tighten. When it comes to capturing wraps, it's the same principle. Spin your thread, place the material fully around the hook shank, Take one and a half loose wraps to capture all the material. Then you can cinch down with tight wraps after that. Thanks for watching today's tying videos. We really hope these video tips help, and as always, we hope to see you out on the water.